We will now transition to a discussion on opportunities and constraints on development in Oceano. As part of our analysis, we developed constraints and opportunity maps to help us determine the best areas to concentrate development. For constraints, we look at environmental factors such as sensitive habitats, wetlands, fire hazard zones, and fault lines. You can see these primarily along the west or left side of Oceano. Agricultural land borders the south and covers the east end of Oceano, indicated in the green blocks. The 100-year flood zone covers the southern and eastern parts of the community, as well as the airport and surrounding neighborhoods, consisting of the largest constraint to the community. Additional constraints include the noise zones along transportation corridors, such as the railroad and highway line. To identify opportunities for development, we looked at vacancies, opportunities for redevelopment, and residential parcels that we identified to have the capacity for ADUs. Vacancies, indicated in the bright pink, were identified by our classmates during a land use inventory data collection that took place last fall. Oceano doesn't have a lot of vacant land for growth. Opportunities for redevelopment, indicated by the hash lines, were identified based on community feedback and the analysis performed by the planning team. With limited vacant land and limitations to expansion in mind, we calculated resident, residential parcels of ADU capacity. These are indicated in yellow. We used existing building footprint data from Slow County and existing parcel data to calculate parcels with vacant land area that is two times the size of an average building footprint. This allowed us to identify over 500 parcels with 7,000 square feet or more of unoccupied land area, which serve as our classification as having the potential for an ADU. <coughs> this map combines both the constraints and opportunities into one graphic, which helped, us, helped guide the development of the alternatives. Surrounded by agriculture and its neighboring cities, Oceano doesn't have much room for expansion. However, there are opportunities for growth within the community. Before diving into alternative development scenarios, we wanted to briefly review community-identified strengths and challenges facing Oceano. Based on community feedback from the previous two meetings, the main strengths of Oceano include its rural, small-town character, the rich agricultural, natural, and cultural resources, Residents' close proximity to fire and emergency services. It's quiet neighborhoods thanks to well-defined industrial and residential areas. Housing that is more affordable relative to other areas in the county. And unique tourist attractions such as the Ocean of Dunes and the American Melodrama. Key challenges facing the community include flooding, especially along Front Street, pedestrian and bicycle safety, issues due to sparse sidewalk, crosswalks, and street lighting, a limited tax base and funding to pay for improvements, and limited diversity in Oceano's economy, limited access to the beach and issues of poor air quality due to the dunes, <coughs> obstacles to improve housing conditions and the need for more diverse types of housing, and minimal parks, sports facilities, and open space. 